I'm in here today I'm gonna show you how actually you can make a snow effects uh, I mean like snowfall effects uh, for your video or picture it's quite easy I'm gonna show you today how you can make it um, this is the video you can see it now how I made it like uh, the snowfall effects you can see it so um, uh, firstly I just gonna get to new comp Okay, I'll just turn this snow. Then the project I already have here is like a city wallpaper. So I just put it here and um, make this comb to fit to the comb. Uh, I'll just change the composition setting because I think it's really shy. I'll make it uh, 1920 height here so it's going to be automatically fit with my comb so it's fit to the comb so you can see uh, the color is like very high I just want to make it darker so for this reason I'm just gonna look for effect called level and put it here and I'll just uh, Increase the whiteness to dark, a little bit darker, so it's gonna be look more realistic now. Then I will choose a new solid. This would be snow. Then I will put effect CC particle system. Uh, CC particle world just put it here so you can see at the beginning it's like this but I do need to change some uh, setting here so firstly I will get to grid uh, not grid uh, but rate um, I'll change it to 3.6 six I'll change the long to um, three point six same then I'll get to the producer position uh, is same is okay uh, the position Y I'll change it to zero point seven zero point zero seven uh, Position jet, I'll change it to 1.49. Radius X, I'll put it 1.885. Radius Y, I'll put 2.335. Radius Z, 3.668. So you can see that um, the, it's already looks like uh, something dropping uh, so right now I'll get to the fix it's explosive it's okay I'm not gonna change anything here I'll just change the, only the floor here um, it's 0 0.2 I will change it to 1 just on the floor position then I'll get to the particle uh, I'll put the particle type fatter spare and bar size I'll increase to about 0 0.68 0 0.68 and depth size I will increase a little bit not too much about 3 so you can see how it looks like uh, this looks like something dropping is like a snow but the color is I have to change it so I will change the yellow to white so now you can see it looks like more realistic then I will change the red to white too so it's going to be looks like more realistic now 
then volume shade is okay I don't want to change anything here I will change the opposite limit um, I will make it like 85% 80 80% 80 is okay or you can change it to 85 uh, I think it is okay then size variation I will increase a little bit uh, 55 I think that's okay yep that looks more realistic I think I feel okay with this one then I'll change some extra setting here. I mean, like effect camera setting. Here, camera is one. I will um, increase to 1.56. I mean, the distance I want to look at a little bit further down. So, um, you can see how it looks like. Then, I'll put a new effect here um, of turbulent displays. And I'll change some setting here because it's a hundred percent size is too much so I will decrease it to 17 not too much I'm mean like just a little bit effect uh, for the comb so now you can see <coughs> amount I will also decrease to 34 mm, 30 is okay I think so after all this I will duplicate this layer Ctrl plus D then I will change some setting only CC particle wall not turbulent displays uh, CC particle system <coughs> I will change the buff rate here um, it's uh, 3.6 I will change it to nearly 6 uh, 6.5 is okay I think then I will change the longevity to 4 Then I'll change some producer setting here. Uh, position X uh, is okay. Uh, I'll just change the position Y here. Uh, two point minus two point three eight or like two two point forty is okay. I think. Then position Z is okay. Radius X. I'm not gonna change radius X. I'll change some setting to um, radius Y. I will put like seven seven. 7, yep, yeah, 7 is okay, I think. About 7, yep. Yeah. So, um, radius just, I'm not gonna change radius jet here. Physics, um, I think physics looks okay. Not the floor position even. Uh, particle, uh, I will change some setting here, particle. Bus size, I can see 0 0.68, I think it's okay. Uh, I will change the depth size about 20. I think 22 is okay. 0 0.22. Um, <clears throat> size variation is okay. Make some opacity. I will decrease it to 75. So now you can see um, here. Uh, one more thing I have to change it. I forgot um, here. Um, <coughs> I have to change the resistance level uh, because I see it's too fast and for the uh, I mean like to make it slow I have to change some setting here uh, resistance level I'll put it about like 18 I think it is okay so now you can see how it looks like and I have to change uh, for the setting here as well because um, it's really fast I can see so I'll put about like 16 here so now you can see so I'll uh, decrease the I mean like this setting I want to start it from 2 seconds uh, so now you can see how it looks like it's nice so <coughs> then I will duplicate this layer snow layer ctrl plus D duplicate it again then I'll change the setting um, here, some of the setting again. <coughs> Buff rate, I will uh, put it like 1 here. Then uh, longevity is okay, 
nearly 3.84 I will change some settings to producer uh, here I can see producer X is ok mm -hmm. I will change the jet about like 13 radius jet and radius Y I will change it to about 4 and radius X I will change it to 4 too then I will get to the physics um, is ok explosive then clock position I will put it about like 1 point about like nearly 2 I will say then I will get to the um, particle uh, I will put only a particle here line instead of fed sphere so you can see how it looks like then um, I will also change um, okay uh, one more thing I have to change it here resistance because it's really too slow um, as I made it a uh, line effect I mean like particle I want to change the resistance as well it's 18 I see um, I will put about Two point three, nearly three, I think. So now you can see it's like more quicker than before, and <coughs> I will also change um, some settings here. I mean, like extras if a camera, I will put it about like two. So now you can see how it looks like. In the opposite, I'll put it about like 80. And now I can see, um, I'm, it looks really nice. I mean, like cool, really cool. And but I want to change one more things here. That's uh, the opposite. I mean, opposite of second layer snow. I'll put T on keyboard you will get the opposite then I will reduce it about like 80% that's okay and I will also change this opposite T about like 90, 88-90% is okay <coughs> and I will also change this one opposite T about like 90% then I will uh, put a new adjustment there and here I will put curve I will put it a little bit darker I mean like I want to see a little bit dark here So I'll put it down here and I'll put the little contrast here so it's gonna look a little bit brighter. <coughs> so now you can see uh, this is my snow effects. Um, I hope guys you enjoy it. Hopefully see you next time and thank you guys for watching it.